Hey guys, it's Alex, and welcome back to Alex's Sports News. Hopefully that you guys are having a good day. Let's get in the video. Starting off with BPL news, Watford side Nathaniel Chalablu from Chelsea on a five-year deal. He's another youngster from Chelsea's academy that's moving on with the likes of Nathan Ake, him, and a few other players leaving the team. In the League One news, Marseille signed Adil Rami from Sevilla for a fee of six million. In Serie A news, Napoli signed Mario Rui from Roma for a fee of five point five million. In Bundesliga news, Bayer Leverkusen signed Sven Bender from Dortmund for a fee of fifteen million. Let me know if that's a good um, deal. And now he's reunited back with his brother Lars. So let let me know if you think that the Twins are going to do good in Bayer. In La Liga news, Barcelona signed Nelson Semedo from Benfica for a fee of 30 to 35 million. The fa Barcelona finally have their uh, replacement for Dani Alves, so, and I, I think he's going to be re a perfect fit for them. Let me know what you think if Nelson Semedo is going to be get a, a good signing, and now Barcelona's defense is getting younger and a lot better, like so Samuel Titi, Ter Stegen, and Semedo. Let me know if you think they're going to, their defense is going to improve after this. And Sevilla signed Sebastian Corchia from um, Lille. In Gold Cup news, Mexico draw 0-0 versus Jamaica. The Mexico and United B and C teams have been underperforming a lot this tournament. Does that tell you a lot about them just struggling? Or the quality in Connell Cap is increasing somehow? Just let me know in the comments below. In NBA news, the Knicks hire Scott Perry as their GM, and then they have Steve Mills becomes their president. A lot of front office changes. Hopefully this turns out a lot better than the Phil Jackson era. But let me know if you think this makes any difference or they will be better now, because they hold off on Carmelo Anthony trading it. Let's see what happens with them. In the MLB news, the Cubs acquire pitcher Jose Quintana from the White Sox in exchange for L.A. Jimenez, their top prospect. Dylan Case, another one of their top prospects. Matt Rose and um, Brian Fleety, just two other prospects. But the White Sox now have the number one farm in MLB, and they're by far the most talented farm, and they should be competing, hopefully, for some World Series soon because of their talent, and I think they're going to have something special in the future. They are rebuilding really well. And that's going to be it for today's video. Hope you guys like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching and peace.